In today's digital landscape, AI-powered video creation offers a compelling alternative to traditional production methods. With just a text prompt, we can transform our ideas into videos through a process known as the text-to-video. Alternatively, we can animate and bring our images to life using image-to-video technology. Nowadays, so many AI-driven video and animation tools are revolutionizing content creation and consumption. However, many users face a common frustration, the limited duration of AI-generated videos, often restricted to just 4, 6 or 8 seconds. These short lengths impede the potential for storytelling and extended ad campaigns. Are you tired of AI tools that restrict your creativity with short video lengths? You are not alone, we hear you. This tutorial unleaves a clever technique to bypass these restrictions and create captivating longer videos effortlessly. Imagine producing commercials or weaving intricate narratives all powered by AI. This method extends your AI-generated masterpieces seamlessly. Stay tuned until the end to learn how to extend AI-generated video duration and unlock AI's full potential for your video productions. It's time to break free and create without limits. In this tutorial, first I am going to demonstrate to you the text-to-video and image-to-video generation methods using an AI called Hyper. After covering the basics, I will also teach you the main trick of extending the length of videos. Please stay with me throughout this tutorial. Additionally, this video contains timestamps so you can jump to any part that interests you. When we visit the Hyper AI website, we create a user account, log into the website. At the top of the website, there is a link to access the main features of this artificial intelligence. Just click on create video with text. On the next, at the bottom of the website, there is a box to enter a prompt. In this box, we can type our ideas in text form. The more detailed our ideas are, the better the AI will understand our needs and generate a better video. Type your prompt or paste it if you already have. In next to the text box, there is an eye icon. Just click on it. With this, we can toggle the create and public option on or off that determines whether the videos we generate with Hyper AI are public or private. Also, there is an another icon next to the eye icon. Just click on it and a list opens up. In the duration section, there is an option to set the length of the video 2 or 4 seconds. Choose 4 seconds. A bit further down, there is an option to set the aspect ratio for vertical and horizontal modes. After all are set, click on the create button. After a short while, Hyper AI generates a video based on the text prompt. Play the video to review. At the bottom of the video frame, there is a download button to get the video for free. At the top of the video frame, there is a regenerate button. By clicking on it, newer videos are generated from the current prompt and settings. Click on the regenerate button several times to create several videos based on the same prompt to get more accurate videos. At the time of publishing this video, all features of Hyper are completely free and there are no limitations on its features. After a short while, new videos are displayed. You can check and download them for free. Review each of them and if needed, download some of them. After the text to video process, I am going to demonstrate to you another feature called image to video process with a practical example. For this purpose, click on the creation mode option at the top of the page. In this section, click on animate your image. You will redirect to a new page where a text box and a section for uploading an image are provided at the bottom of the site. Just click on the upload image icon and select the image you want to convert to a video. After a short while, the image is uploaded and its thumbnail is displayed. In this mode, we need to type our needs and expectations for animating the image in the form of a prompt. This means we need to write how we want the AI to animate the image and specify what we want to happen in the image so that the AI can animate the image accordingly and generate it as a video. After that, click on the settings icon next to the text box. In the drop-down list, select video duration in the duration section. 
After all is set, click on the create button. After a short while, the AI animates image based on the text you typed in, which is a prompt and generates a video. Play the video to review. Download button is below the video frame, so you can download the video if needed. At the top of each video frame, there is a button called regenerate. By clicking on it, newer videos are generated based on the image we uploaded under the current prompt and settings. Click the regenerate button several times to get more accurate videos. Up to this point in the tutorial, you have learned how to create custom videos using AI with features like text to video and image to video. The method I have taught you for generating videos is the same across all active AI platforms. However, the key point here is that these videos are short typically around 4 seconds. In the next section, I will teach you a trick to bypass this limitation. In this section, I am going to demonstrate to you a practical way to extend the length of videos generated with AI in step by step. The video you are watching now is 4 seconds long which is generated by Hyper AI. I downloaded and saved on my hard drive. To extend the length of this same video, we need a video editing application like CapCut which is completely free or softwares like Adobe Premiere Pro or Filmora. Here, I am using Filmora to do the task. Launch the application and select new project. Import the video file which you want to extend. Drag and drop the video file onto the timeline which creates a sequence based on its settings. Place the playhead on the last frame of the video. The main trick is to take a screenshot of the last frame and input that into the image to video process. If an AI generates a new 4 seconds video using that screenshot, you can then combine the new video with the original. Just click on the camera icon to take the screenshot of the last frame of the video. A new window opens where you enter a name for the screenshot and you can set the format to JPEG. It will save on your hard drive location. Now return to the Hyper AI website. To convert the screenshot into a video, click on creation mode. Then on animate your image. At the bottom of the new page, click on upload image. Select and upload the screenshot you created earlier. After a short while, the image is uploaded and its thumbnail is displayed. Type in the ideas you want AI to animate this image with and convert it into a video in the prompt box. Click on the settings button next to the text box. In the duration section, set the duration to 4 seconds and then click create. After a short while, a new video is generated based on the image. You repeat this process and create many videos using this method. Now review the videos and select one that is satisfactory, then download it. You successfully created the second video based on the last frame of video number 1, so the two videos are next to each other. Go to the Filmora and import the second video into the project. Drag and drop the second video after the first one. In this way, the first and second videos are next to and in continuation of each other, effectively making the total video length 8 seconds. With this trick, you can even create much longer videos using AI. To export, click on the export button at the top of Filmora. A new window opens, just enter a name for the output file. Specify the save location and click the export button which exports the video file after a short time. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial on extending the length of AI videos. If so, please give the video a like and share it with your friends. Thanks for watching and there are many more AI tutorials on the way. Subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out. The future is AI, so embrace it. See you in the next video.